Six things Americans pay for, while Europeans enjoy for free. 1. College Americans spend more on college than almost any other country. The average annual college cost is $35,720. Germany, Sweden, and Denmark offer free colleges. The Swedes can get several degrees for free. Even foreign students can enroll free of charge. But European education is not entirely free. Taxpayer money covers the tuition. Higher taxes support more social services. Sweden has the world's highest taxes. Taxes contribute 50.6% to the country's GDP. In the US, taxes make up only 17% of the GDP. It comes back to you. As one Swede says, two, vacation. The US is the only advanced country that doesn't guarantee paid time off. Only 13 countries share this situation. Most nations provide universal paid vacation. UK employees have 28 days of paid leave. Austrian workers get 13 paid holidays. Danish workers get at least five weeks of paid leave. US workers aren't entitled to a single day off with pay. Any paid vacation is at the employer's discretion. This leaves 25% of Americans without paid vacation. 3. Parental leave. Paid parental leave is the norm in Europe. In Belgium, parents have four months of leave. Austrians can take up to two years with their baby. Each parent in Sweden is entitled to 240 days of paid leave. One parent may take all 480 days. Meanwhile, the US lacks a national policy. Maternity leave policies differ by employer. Not all employers provide paid leave. New mothers may lose some salary when taking time off. Most Americans get 12 weeks of unpaid leave. 4. Health care. The US is the only wealthy nation without universal health care. This system provides options for people. They can choose the plan that suits them. Government-funded health care reduces costs. But any time you get care, someone has to pay. Finland's health care is a single-payer system. Health care is provided through private facilities. The government pays the bills. Patients might have a small copay in certain cases. Israel even funds fertility treatments. 5. Daycare. In Denmark, two-year-olds have guaranteed daycare spots. Parents pay a maximum of 25% of the cost. The rest is covered by the government. The guarantee lasts until the children are 10. Government assistance is available if parents prefer to stay home or hire a nanny. Two-year-olds in the U.S have limited access to formal childcare. Parents pay more than $10,000 a year for childcare. Finding an available spot can be competitive. The US spends a mere 0.2% of its GDP on childcare. 6. Baby supplies. In Finland, all new moms receive a cardboard box from the government. The box serves as a bassinet. It comes with all the baby essentials, like a sleeping pad, diapers, and more. In the US, Parents have to shop for these items on their own. Bonus point, school lunches. Many US public school students qualify for free or reduced price lunches. French school lunches are also heavily subsidized, but France takes cafeteria standards to the next level. Every French meal is checked by a dietitian. Fresh ingredients are used daily. French kids even get a menu to choose from.